Ladies and ladies and gentlemen, my name is Lou Axe. We are here for the undercard press conferences for Johnny versus Deadpool. Live this Saturday. Two more days to go in Las Vegas. MGM Grant. Top five cruiserweights are going to put it on the line and see who could potentially be next for the defending champion, Bowser Jr., who's coming off a split decision win over Mega Man two, month, two weeks ago. But we're going to bring up undercard fighters first. First, coming up to the stage with a record of 12 wins and three losses. Please welcome Dry Bones. What's up, y'all? Dry Bones. Dry Bones. Dry bones. Yeah, let's go. What's up, y'all? I can't Pussy. win. Uh, uh, okay, thank you. And now his opponent coming up to the stage with an undefeated record of 13 wins and no losses. Please, with with uh, 12 of his wins come by way of knockout, please welcome the prospect, the man himself, Cloud. Uh, yeah, what's up, y'all? I'm ready. I'm going to knock uh, this guy out cold, bro. I can't uh, win. Get the fuck off the stage. Who has the first question? Uh, question for Dry Bones. What's up? How do you feel about being on this event with um Johnny and Deadpool? Bro, you know, it's it's a crazy environment out here. You know, we got a bunch of crazy shit. I saw all the fucking footage and stuff all online. It was wild, bro. They It's personal. I'm actually going to, uh, after the fight with Cloud, I'm going to stay in attendance if I can and watch the fight because I'm excited for this one, you know? Especially since it's in my weight class in Cruiserweight. So I could definitely see myself fighting these guys if I get myself a lot of wins. Bro, you're not going to beat him. You're, you're not even going to beat me. No one even asked for your opinion. Bro, you're just sitting here talking out of turn. Like, bro, just shut the fuck up, bitch. What the fuck you going to do? I'm going to knock your ass out cold. Guys, let's calm down. Next question. Uh, question for Cloud. Yo. Do you respect Dry Bones for this fight? I mean, I respect him for taking the fight. But besides that, he's a whole bitch. Yeah, I'm Dutch a bitch. Even though I took the fight, you fucking retard. Bitch, shut up. You're a whole bum. And plus, I'm going to knock you out easily. You're light work for me, bro. You're literally light work. You're a bum. I'd sleep you in the first round. I'm not. You're not making it through one round with me. Bro, you're going to get absolutely knocked out. We'll see. When I beat you and your undefeated streak goes goodbye, bitch, you'll see who's boss. Yeah, we'll see who's boss, you old bitch. I'm going to knock you out easily. You're light work. Yes, I'm definitely light work. You're in for a real rude awakening. Yeah, all right. Next question. Uh, Dry Bones, would you ever step in a ring with um, <clears throat> Josh the Drew? I don't even know who that is. Bro, nah, I ain't really interested in that matchup. He is a good fighter. He's uh, about 6 and 0, 7 and 0, maybe. Mm, that's impressive. Still not very interested. You know you'd get knocked out. Bro, shut up. You're a whole bum. You're doing a lot of talking over here. Bro, I am literally know I'm going to knock you out. You're literally a stepping stone for my cruise to the title. You're really going to see who's boss in that ring on Saturday when I absolutely slap you up to shreds, you bitch. Yeah, all right. You're a bum. I'd knock you out easily. You're a whole bum, bro. I'd fucking sleep your ass. Yeah, right. You're getting knocked out cold. Next question. Uh, question for both fighters. What's up? What's up? What is your thoughts on Team Cobra Kai? Pretty interesting team, you know. Uh, there's a part of me that might want to go down there and train. You know, there's a lot of good fighters I respect down there. Terry, so I respect Johnny. Uh, you got uh, Johnny's a guy I respect. He's the guy that motivated me to box. So I, I honestly got a lot of respect for him. Um, to be honest, I respect Terry Silver for doing his thing. You know, he made a huge name for himself. And I can't hate on that. You know, I, I fuck with those guys, but they're cool. Knuckles is another worthy fighter who I respect, you know. And you got Jake Paul. He's a pretty good. He proved himself against Anderson Silva. You got Kobe Covington who got robbed against Kamara Usman two times. Yeah. So, I mean, yeah. We all know Usman clearly won both fights. Bitch, no, he didn't. 
Covington was Covington was slapping him up in the later round. Okay, and he still lost. He got dropped two times. He got dropped like this. His whole draw was broke. Bitch, he was winning the first fight, and he got robbed in the second one. In the oh, first one, yeah. it was a terrible stoppage. All right, who has the uh, next question? Question for Cloud. Yo. How has training been going for you for this fight? Training is going great. You know, I've been putting in the work. Uh, honestly, I have... Um, I'm honestly extremely confident. I put a lot of hard work into the fuck is going on out there? Who's getting murdered? So anyway. That shit's uh, crazy. Yeah, I know, right? Fucking police officers and shit. You're probably going to need some for here after the main event goes quite crazy. Uh, for sure. But back to what I'm saying. Um, I've been training and putting in a lot of work. And I know what I'm going to do up there. I'm going to sleep your ass. Yeah, sure you are. When you get fucking slept on the canvas, and you go, oh, I lost that dry bones. I bones with my daddy. Yeah, yeah. I am your daddy, bitch. Yeah, right. The only thing your daddy of is your dead corpse. Oh, shut the fuck up, you dumb bitch. Guys, chill, chill, chill. Who has the next question? Uh, question for dry bones. Yo. We all, we all know that you just wrapped up training. Yeah. And you already made a way up. <clears throat> Everyone has been underestimating you about this fight. They're saying that you took an easy opponent. They're saying that you haven't been against the top level. What is your thoughts, and What do you say about that? I think they're just bullshitting to themselves. You know, listen, uh, as much as me and Cloud are sitting there talking a bunch of shit, he's 13 and 0. He's KO'd almost every opponent he's fought. He's not made it past the second round. Actually, no, he did go past the second round one. But besides, he got he dominated that match. I took a tough fight to get myself a win because if I get a win over this guy, I can just get my experience up a little bit beating an unbeaten prospect. And then we can talk about some other fighters, you know? I don't think I took a. I think I took a pretty damn difficult challenge in this match. Well, you just made a big mistake. You took a death wish in this one. Now that's a little too far, bitch. No, it's not. I'm gonna sleep you. You're easy word for me. You're a bum. I'm gonna knock you out cold, bro. I'm literally just gave you a bunch of credit, and you're still saying you're talking shit because you a whole ass mark. You a bitch. What are you a gangster? You look like a Japanese fucking doll. Get the fuck out of here with that bullshit. And you look like a fucking mummy just came out of its fucking three-year hibernation. Where'd you get that one from? Your own ass? All right, guys. Calm down. Calm down. Next question. Uh, question for Dry Bones. Yo. Will we ever get see you in... See you in WWE or in a boxing exhibition match with Floyd Mayweather? Bro, I would smoke Floyd Mayweather. He's easy work for me. And honestly, WWE, I never had much interest in um, going into WWE. But, you know, uh, boxing Floyd Mayweather would be such a fucking amazing thing to see. He still got it. I mean, he beat in some good fighters in exhibition fights. No, the fuck he didn't. Bro, he beat Deji. Deji's a whole bum. Bro, you fight Deji then. Dude, I would destroy Deji. Look at my last opponent. I would kill Deji. That's a mismatch, bro. I ain't fussy. What the fuck am I seeing? <laughs> what the fuck is happening? Sounds like a whole ass murder spree going on out there. Fuck. Damn. What the fuck, bro? Ugh. <sighs> All right, next question. Uh, a few more questions, and um, we're going to wrap this up. Yeah. Um, Cloud, after yeah. this fight, who do you want to fight next? I don't know, man. We'll just see who's higher up in the ranks. You know, I see Mewtwo is undefeated. Dr. Eggman's a fat shit. I'd knock him out easily. I mean, these guys beat a dry bones. And I, I'm going to beat him, and then I'll move up, bro. I'm going to knock them all out. They're all not on my level. Cuphead can get it, too. I've seen him. He's unranked. Shazam, what's good? All these guys can get it. I'll destroy all of them. Yeah, right. You're talking out your own ass. Bro, you're just a bum who can't fight. Bitch, and I ain't no bum. I have 12 wins, and seven of them came by knockout in round three. 
You have any first round knockout? I have two. You're a bum. I'm a bum, but you ain't have any wins, bro. 12 and 3, bitch. Is there a zero? Are you blind? Are you deaf? You really want to get some hearing aid with your fucking little Japanese toy looking ass. Look like you came out of whole sushi. Yeah, shut the fuck up. You look like you came out of a whole coffin during a zombie apocalypse. Yeah, right. All right, a couple more questions, then we're going to get a face off. Uh, question for Dry Bones. Yeah. Will we? Will you ever fight Brock Lesnar? Bro, Brock Lesnar can get it too, but he'll have to come down to my weight. I, bro, actually, he's too fat. I can move up to heavyweight and knock him out. But honestly, first I gotta make a name for myself. I'm gonna start with that on uh, a big card, beating an undefeated prospect, and um. They're going to see real quick why I'm going to be a real threat to these guys. Okay. Uh, question for Cloud. Yo. Uh, will we ever see you on another Johnny event? Bro, I don't really care. I'm done to fight anytime, any place, anywhere. I mean, Johnny is a guy I respect, so I would definitely have to fight on his undercard again. You know, it's an honor to be on this card, and uh, yeah. Yeah, you're just doing a lot of meat riding, bro. Shut up. I know. I I respect not many people, but Johnny's a guy I respect for his skills, and he's he's willing to fight anybody. You'll literally fight anyone. You know, he's calling up these guys, and they ain't gonna fight him because they're just scared. What is with you, dick riding Johnny, bro? Like, I don't need to answer this question twice, but I don't care. I'm knocking your ass out cold, and we're gonna see. Any more questions? All right, final question for both fighters. All right, what's the question? What are y'all going to do November 19th? All right, I'll go first. Um, I'm going to go out there. I'm going to make him think, oh, shit, I should have taken this fight. I'm going to beat his ass and knock him out. First round. No, you ain't. You, you're, you're, you're just lying to yourself. Bro, your little loss are all first round knockouts. Ain't nothing new. I don't care. I do not care. I'll take on anyone. And my prediction, I'm going to dominate him and finish him off. I'm going to batter him and then finish him off to make a statement. All right. Okay. Any more questions or is that it? That's all. All right. That's the first undercard for Johnny vs. Deadpool. Cloud, dry bones. Your opener card. Three rounds. Cruiserweight match. Let's get the face off. Okay, guys, please don't hit each other. Bro, you're gonna get knocked out. Yeah, right. I'm gonna end you out there. You ain't gonna end shit. You're a bum. I'm gonna knock you out unconscious. You're easy work for me. Oh, I'm easy work. I'm easy work. Is that so? It is just Bro, you're mean and knock the fuck out. Face forward, please. Hey, you a fish, bro. I swear to God, yeah, whatever. Let's go. 14 and 0. Yeah, 13 and 1. Get your ass out of here. You get your ass out of here. That makes me think. Oh, you want to come? Got to do this. Chill, 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 chill. What's up, that bitch? I'm not too long right now. What's up, bro? What's up? What's up, bro? What's up, bro? What's up? Get up. Get up. Guys, chill, chill, chill. You that way, you that way. Go and we'll see if the way in tomorrow. Let's we'll see, bitch. You're a bum. You're a bum. But you're losing. You're getting the first walk on Saturday. Who? That got real intense there between these two. Cloud and Dry Bones, your opener car. Now to our next press conference.